Hey guys, how's it going? This is Matinator, and welcome back to Dreamfall The Longest Journey. So, I'm carrying on right from last time, and we're infiltrating Watty Corp's base, and I've just been standing here for ages, so, you know, it seems that no one really comes around here. Anyway, uh, let's carry on. I can't access this. Even live software wouldn't stand a chance against the security systems Watty employ. This looks like the kind of capsule I need to scan the worm. Alright, let's take one. After inserting the worm into the capsule, you'll need to scan it. You'll also need to scan yourself. The scanners, with my remote assistance, will upload both yours and the worm's DNA into the DreamCore's guardware. This will allow you access through the airlock. Both scanners are located in the med lab. Okay, so I'm guessing this isn't the med lab. No spiders. Cool. I guess uh, I'll go this way just because it's safer. Maybe this is the med lab if I'm lucky. Uh, no, I'm not lucky at all, unfortunately. Right. Well, let's carry on then. But, um, yes. So, maybe this is it. Looks like it. I need to disable the security oh, before fuck. going in. There. Okay, okay. This way then. Thankfully, these spiders and all that shit are very crap. They're very, very crap. Why is there one standing right there for? This must be it. Ah, okay, here we are. Come on, come on, open the door. Hurry up. Alright. Here we are. This console is locked. And the All protection right. is probably airtight. Without live around, I wouldn't risk trying to access it. Um, am I supposed to be in here? I'm not entirely sure. Do I put the capsule in you? No. Mobile you? No. Okay. No. I'm capsule. Do I scan? Capsule? No. Uh. Wait. What's this? A worm. Oh, I'm supposed to put the worm inside the capsule. Yeah, there we go. Encapsulated worm. Now I just have to figure out how to use it. I'm not sure, I don't... I'm guessing I'm not supposed to be in here yet. Maybe I have to go this way more. Okay, so there's the spider. The med lab must be around here somewhere. Maybe it's the one down this hole? Let's try that. I have no idea what this is. Those elevators go up to oh. the ground floor. But I won't be going up that way, unfortunately. Yep. Seems that way. Okay. Come on, Spidey, go away. Ah, okay, this looks like it. Yes. Okay, cool, cool, cool. It's a full-body scanner. It reads all my biometric data and uploads it to the system. Okay, so if I put this in there... Cool. DNA and cellular composition of biological entity analyzed and cleared for entry and insertion into core. Right. Great. So now I can step into this, right? DNA and cellular composition analyzed. After you scan both the worm and yourself, you need to locate a key to the core room. The security officer in shift won't be in his office. I'll make sure of that. But Rio told me they always keep a spare key around. That's in blatant violation of security procedures, but it makes our job a lot easier. You'll need to search the security officers to find it. Right. Uh, which way were the security officers again? Crap, crap, crap. Alright, let's just go this way. I'll find it sooner or later. It seems that this way is safer. Better to be safe rather than sorry. We will be... Um... No, this isn't it. 
It's going to be one of the last two. There were two more doors that we had to go in. Maybe it's this one. If I'm lucky... Oh, it looks like this one. Oh, crap, no. This is the door that... Okay, 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 stop, stop. Zoe, stop. Okay. <clears throat> I know where we're going. It's this one, isn't it? Yes, it is, it is. Get in there. Come on, Zoe. The security in this office is pretty heavy. I'll need to do exactly what Damien told me to do. The security office has an isolated grid that isn't connected to the building systems. If it's on, I'm afraid you're going to have to disengage <sighs> that too. It can be switched off from the inside by one of the security spiders. Check the cybernetics office. There should be an extra spider in there. Use the software I uploaded to your mobile to control it remotely. Inside the security office, there'll be a dock where the spider can access the local grid. The spider you'll be controlling won't have the right security clearance, however. So you'll need to find a way to upgrade its clearance. If you fry one of the patrolling spiders and download its clearance, you should be able to dock with the security office grid. Okay. This is getting very complicated, but I remember that the spider thingy is around here somewhere. Actually, it's that right there. It's that shadow, I'm pretty sure. Yes, that would be it. Lucky I have the ability to see shadows through walls. Alrighty, let's get me mobile out and popped on. Oh, cool. I'm this now. How do I attack? Um, I don't know how to attack, but we'll figure it out when we get to it. Cool. This is a pretty cool thing. Woo! Alright. So there's one there. I just need to wreck it. Here we go. I'm gonna kill it. Woo! Alright. So now I have clearance. Is this it? Oh yeah. I'm too good at this game. Okay, maybe I should have like killed the other one as well, because then I wouldn't have to worry about spiders at all. Ah, uh, I don't care. All right. Who would be stupid enough to leave a data key in a jacket pocket? Yes, idiots. <laughs> when you found the spare key in the security office. Use it to enter the core room. We need to get the worm into the dream core. Once that's done, I can start pulling information from the core to my console. To get to the core, you must pass through the airlock and a decontamination process. And don't worry, it's perfectly harmless. From this point on, you'll need to be vigilant. There's a team on duty in the core room, most likely two or three scientists. They'll be preoccupied, however, so you should be able to sneak past them. If they spot you, they'll trigger the alarm, and you'll be fried, literally. Go to the lower platform. That's where you'll find the injection tube. Insert the capsule with the worm into the tube, push the button, and the worm will do the rest. After that, all you need to do is stay low and get out as fast as you can. I'll cut the alarm to the fire exit at the agreed time, so be there. If anything should go wrong, you'll need to find another way out on your own. Right. Well, I'm guessing something's going to go wrong, because he wouldn't have told me that otherwise. But despite that, Everything is going exactly to plan, right, as as of now. And I'm just kind of wondering as well, like, the way that he says, um... Oh, I've come the wrong way, haven't I? Oh, well. We'll get there eventually. But just the way that he says, like, the scientists will be preoccupied, so I just have to sneak past them, like... He's basing that on just, like, nothing. Like, it could be a day where they're not busy... And then I'm just fucked. So it's like, yeah. I don't know. <clears throat> Maybe I'm just being too, I don't know, too mean. Meh, who cares? Let's do this shit. 
I hope this key is active. Looks active to me. Okay, here we go. Excuse me while I crack open a drink because my throat is a bit sore. There we go. <clears throat> ah. Very good. Oh, right. Got to start creeping now. Sheesh. She's just like, wow, I have no peripheral vision and I'm just super busy right now. Hmm. <laughs> what the hell was that face, Zoe? She just had a real, like, bitch's face. Oh, oh, what are you doing? What are you doing? Huh? Huh? Where are you going? Where did she get to? Oh, do you think that she'll be able to see me? I'm just creeping and she has no peripheral vision, so we're all good. Now, who's down here? Oh, fuck, fuck, fuck. Is that guy completely retarded? Hey, what are no. You doing here? No one's here. Oh. <coughs> wow, my body was so surprised by getting shocked that I sneezed. Pardon me. Okay, so I thought that that guy would be a complete retard and let me go, but unfortunately, he's a bit smarter than that. Yeah, okay, okay, we've seen this. Alright. So the old guy comes up the staircase. Such great timing, too. Okay, so I gotta utilize this third person thing. I can't really see him, though. Where is he? He should be coming up the stairs right about now. There he is. Alright. And then I gotta keep an eye on the other woman. There she is over there. Lucky I have the power to see through walls. Oh crap. Oh shit, I'm gonna be stuck between them. Can you fuck off? There we go, he's going. Come on, come on, come on, come on. There we go, there we go, there we go. Down, 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 down. Down, 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 down. Okay, who's on this floor? No one. It's good, 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 good. Put the thingy in there, right? Yep, that looks right. Alright! We've done it. Even if I die now, they can't do anything about it. Good job, Wormy boy. She's getting agitated. We need to calm her down. The core's definitely reacting to external stimuli. But what? This doesn't look like the normal spikes. And there's absolutely no activity on Dreamnet. What's eating her? Good question. Whatever it is, it's serious. I've never seen her like this. Uh-oh. Guess who decided to pay us a little visit? Gilmore. <coughs> None other. She's probably here for another status report. Why can't she just be happy with the daily briefings from the Chief? Don't say anything stupid, okay? I don't fancy getting fired just because you shoot your mouth off to her. She is the boss. And what idiot gave her that job? She has absolutely no qualifications at- Shh. <laughs> Miss Gilmore, what an unexpected honor. May we help you with anything? I thought I'd come down here to check oh, on the Jesus. progress myself. Why are there only two of you here? It's Sunday evening. The team can't work 24 hours a day. They'll start making mistakes and... We're on shifts, Miss Gilmore. Dr. Lee and I have the call until tomorrow morning. Shifts? We're four months away from launch, everything's gone to hell, and your team's working shifts. People can take the day off when this crisis has been resolved. If Alchera doesn't launch as planned, you'll all be fired. I don't think you... I couldn't care less what you think. 
That's not what I pay you for. I pay you to find out who's fucking with my project. We're working on that. But it's been a difficult day. There have been spikes, and the leakage is getting worse. Meaning what? There have been fresh outbreaks of static interference across the wire, coinciding with violent fluxes in Angana. What sort of fluxes? Both physical spasms, like... like nervous twitches, and, and, and bursts of pure energy, and, and data. Hugely, hugely complex bursts of data. It doesn't make sense, but Angana appears to be... How shall I put this? Expanding, okay? There's, there's, there's more data inside it than it can physically store. How is that even possible? It really isn't. That's also why it's overloading, creating spikes that travel at the speed of light into the wire. If it keeps expanding... We might theoretically be able to shut it down. But we don't know what consequences that might have, both to the project and to the wire. It could be catastrophical. Everything connected to the wire, and I mean everything, could conceivably be affected. It's not an option. Disregarding the possible effects to the wire, if there's any chance the project's timeline will be thrown off, it's unacceptable. You'll have to identify the problem and isolate the intrusion into the system. Now, I want a detailed breakdown of what your team's doing and when I can expect to see concrete results. Can we stabilize the Dream Core? For short periods of time, which gives us a window to test DreamNet. Angana has responded positively to direct infusions of Morpheus. All right. Walk me through the process. <laughs> so he's just like, oh, I've been here for like five minutes. I want to go home. <clears throat> oh, what's this? Huh. Huh. We're playing as Cape Girl again. I forget what her name is because it's been so long. But we're playing as her now. Interesting. <coughs> Pardon me, I'm so sorry about that. I'm all out of lozenges right now. And I don't really think you're supposed to have that many, but they're really tasty, so I kind of eat them anyway. That's him, the man I've been following. Oh, right. I remember that guy. Oh, I remember now, right. She chased him down the well. Wait, did I say well? I mean, down the journeyman inn thing. I haven't seen any other boats here. I'll need to find some other way to get to the other side. Um, well, it's definitely not happening that way. How am I supposed to get... Oh. Oh, you tell me it opens now? I remember I tried opening that- Oh yeah, of course it opens now. It wouldn't open for me before. It wouldn't do anything before. Wait, wait, don't close. Wait, no! Fuck. Damn it. What was that all about? Am I supposed to get in there now? Oh. The creature didn't touch the door. It just opened it, as if by magic. Some magic then. <laughs> Always, with, Always the magic. with the magic. One of those creatures uh, sang to the door, and it opened up. Magic. Alright, alright. Hmm. How am I going to do this? Alright. That creature didn't touch the door. It just opened as if by magic so magic why can't i just swim with the magic. honestly is there a big problem with swimming seems that every character in these games is oh shit oh shit no no oh shit it saw me didn't it what is it doing where the hell did it go I think what I'm supposed to do is follow it in, maybe. But where the fuck did it go? Did it come down here? Did it hide? What's this? I can't pick that up. 
Huh. Strange. Very strange indeed. I guess that's what I gotta do then. I'm gonna have to stand over here and wait until one of those goblin things comes to open the door and then I'll follow him in. Ah, oh, this is gonna take a while. Oh wait, there he is. Ah, so he was just waiting for me to go away. Don't you worry, little goblin man, I'm going to follow you in. I'm gonna follow you in in the next episode. Oh, alright, so um, I'm all out of time for this episode, and unfortunately, I'm actually... Well, actually, no. Sorry, screw that. I'm out of time for this episode, so... Um, I hope you guys are enjoying the series. I hope you enjoyed this video. And, well, I'll see you guys in the next piece of shit that I upload, so stay tuned for more.